So we're here at the Princess McKinley Lodge um, uh, in Denali State Park, and a great example of a, of a renewed tradition of the great lodges of the early 19th century that really spun out of um, the birth of national parks merged with the railroad and people's disposable income to be able to come to recreate to places like this. So uh, hallmarks of a great lodge are um, you know, wonderful viewing areas. You see over here we have all these um, seats that are oriented just to look out at the vistas, just look, look out at the views. There's all kinds of seating areas, big giant fireplaces. Typically these are in alpine mountainous areas where they tend to be cold, at least during some times of the year. So we have big fires going on, game rooms, areas where families can get together. Um, uh, art and various types of interpretation in these great lodges. Um, all kinds of interpretive programs as well. Now, in typical national parks, this would be led by national park rangers. Um, these days, we have a lot of concessionaires like Starbucks that are right here. Um, but over here, we have what look to be state park rangers. In fact, are all just um, employees of, of Princess Cruise Line, which is the owner of this. But they do have a decent amount of interpretive um, elements going on about natural history. Again, most of the folks who come here are quite naive in terms of the ecology of, in this case, Alaska. Um, and in addition to uh, uh, these areas, there's also tons of gift stores, and a, a current hallmark of our era seems to be the gift store merged with the um, interpretation. So here we have this really cool um, history uh, timeline of mountaineering on Denali and it leads you right into the gift shop. Um, all of this design is very much sort of Alpine Village. This particular building was completed, opened in 1997 and uh, hosts folks primarily from May to September each year. So again, this is the Princess McKinley Lodge in Denali State Park looking at Denali Peak looking at the property of Denali National Park from this 147 acre private inholding here. Pretty cool.